Hi everyone, I hope you're all. This is Coins Kid. I'm just going to dive into XLP once again. Thank you for support. Okay, big up the Coins Kid crew. Thank you to each and every single one of you for everything that you do. Honestly, thank you for your subscription. Thank you for liking this video, and thank you for leaving a comment as well. You know, and I do try and take time out to reply to all the comments. Just thank you. Thank you for your support. Honestly, I'm going to do a live stream tomorrow for the Patreons in the Discord around about five o'clock UK time. So if you want to hop into there, I'll be in there and I'll do a live stream and answer some. Q and A's on loads of coins. I think the last one I did around about 150 coins or something. It was about three, four hours long. So I will spend some time with you tomorrow doing that live stream. Okay. So right now, XRP. Look at this. It's golden. Look, you're breaking out. You're out of resistance. You're coming back. You're holding support of this previous level of resistance that you've broken. It's golden. So what I'm going to do? I've done this before using a thought experiment, basically, because you can see this is longer. This is drawn out. You see this level of consolidation. We hit a high and we fell into this correction just there, and this was more drawn out than this one. Okay, so for me, this is the same as this. Okay, but it's this is more drawn out basically. So we we really have come into the apex here before we started to break out, come back to a key level support, and we're starting to go up the stairs basically i'm not saying it's going to be an instant journey that we do something like this okay it might be i might be completely wrong but i'm going to show you something right now that if we follow this similar pattern here i can give you the pinpoint deadline of when we get to 450 okay by the minimal by the minimal time frame right here, using the four experiments so basically we had this eye here came into this low okay came up coiled up broke out the apex see you later okay met that impulsive wave target we've done exactly the same here look at the waveforms like i said to you you come down your abc look at that very very similar you got double bottom double bottom and then you've come up and you you know consolidated in a in a horizontal basically lower highs higher lows boom break the resistance up you go basically you did exactly the same there but you've broken out a bit prematurely here of this horizontal uh, basically okay so for me using this thought experiment and it, this is honestly don't say nothing i say is financial advice but let's look at this as a thought experiment okay so that was your high that was your low and that was your high and then you started to come up and look when we met the high of the 1.618 fib target which was a target from this high uh, from this high to this low up we go let me show you for those that are new to the channel okay so this is a thought experiment doesn't mean it has to happen you know so from there today you can see that we had that high we had that low and then our impulsive wave took all the way up to this two on this trend based fib time tool basically and you can see we got to the 1618 round about there on the 13th of april bang on the two do you see that so let's drop this particular tool on this particular chart here that this level of uh, upside and downside that we've gone through for xrp so from there the high to the low this is your low just there because you came up and you made a higher low just there because that was a wick low so just there to this high just there you can see that basically xrp could be at the latest four dollars fifty by the 31st of december uh, this year okay that's when you could be looking at that impulsive wave break bringing us up to this upside here on the two because we met this 1618 just here on the two on the 14th where is that the 13th yeah around about the 14th of april wasn't it so using trend based fib time this is the projection that i have so at the absolute latest you could be looking at that for xrp so from here right now that is a further appreciation of around about 295 percent for xrp up to the 31st of uh, December if we go through this very similar cycle here where we go along and then we start to break out to the upside so you, and it start to break out and have a huge huge impulsive break like we did in the previous uh, bull market if we move over to here look we came all the way in the impulsive uh, in, in the horizontal and then we started to break out and looking in the month of December there we started to break out and take off into space so this for me okay this for me is a minimal 1618 target but who knows at this point we might absolutely start to go parabolic and at this point we might take off and start to get some of these yellow trend lines okay these are the fibs this is 1272 this is 1414 and this is 1.1618 which I personally believe you know I personally believe we would be attacking that at the moment if it wasn't for this uh, court case it sort of held um, XRP back okay so I do think we'd potentially be up here already at the 1272 doing something like this and then this December we'll be looking at that kind of blow off top up there for, for, for XRP but there is theories that we are looking at some kind of lengthening cycle here moving into next year so potentially you know have this run up here into December roll back to a key level of support which I will give you and then potentially we could go again into the year and this is where these targets could be met purely because in January I think it's January January the uh, 16th or something there might be some kind of news out about this 
SEC case, okay, for, for, for XRP. So there might be a green light. And at that point, you know, we start to retrace. And everyone's like, oh, shit, the, bear, the bull market's over. XRP's going to zero. But then XRP, on its own, takes off into space. And this is where these yellow trend lines may potentially get met. So, yeah, full transparency. I do anticipate that so far we're conforming. We're doing everything we need to for the continuation of the bull. We're breaking out resistance, falling back to support, holding the support. We're looking for continuation. So based off his trend-based fib time, you know, this one played out. Absolute T, wasn't it, on the two? So this is absolutely at the latest. December the 31st, I think it is, yeah, on the two fib right there. That's when you could be looking at XRP being at around about $4.55, which is a technical target of an impulsive break off this high just here and this low basically and you now coming up impulsively up the stairs breaking levels of resistance for continuation of the ball so yeah it's all really really good isn't it you know for me xrp it, when it breaks down it's 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 not breaking down a lot is it you know and you're holding support like i said to you on the daily look you're falling back to this trend line so this is really good this is the trend line that you want to adhere to so right now potentially like i said to you come back create a little handle Look, you've got this lovely little cup and handle pattern. You start to come back up now and break this trend line. You've got that impulsive target that brings you up to there. And then you start to break that high. You're looking at that impulsive target, which brings you up to there. You know, So you're slowly going up the stairs, aren't you? Potentially in December, we get sort of that massive, insane rally to the upside there for XRP. So yeah, that's basically XRP. Just a quick little update for you today, showing you p potentially where we could actually hit the $4.50 by the minimal time frame. okay? But again, nothing to say is financial advice, and it's all a thought experiment, and I might be doing it wrong. Who knows? But it's just a thought experiment. I like to do that, do these on this channel. Okay, thank you for your support. Take care, everyone. Back to another XRP update. Stay healthy, stay strong, stay tuned. Bye-bye.